Isaiah chapter 26 verse 3, NKJV. You will keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on you, because he trusts in you. What a spectacular promise of peace consisting of two parts you and one part God. Your parts, first, you trust God. Just like with your fellow man, you will come to trust him by getting to know him. Where to start? If you wanted to know someone and there was a book about them, wouldn't you would read it to find out who they are? Second, your mind is stayed on him. This means consistently refocusing your scattered, doubt-filled thoughts on his word. God's part. As you're learning to trust God and daily practice the art of directing the mayhem in your mind back to him. He promises to keep you in perfect peace. You'll never do this perfectly. Not ever. And that's okay. He knows this and won't withhold his peace when you miss it. More than anything, he longs to be your peace, and can be when you trust and cling to his promises. Peace is yours in every situation because God is with you. In the middle of pain and sickness, bad reports, and unmet expectations. He is your peace. In the natural, it doesn't make any sense, but that's why it's called the peace that passes understanding. Peace doesn't come from everything being right and rosy. It comes from him. And he is always with you.